recording right oh yeah we're recording okay <laughs> this is agent fish i thought it was another this is agent log love oh, God. um we're here to talk about boys. boys um my favorite subject yeah and also one of my favorite subjects to talk about um we've all had our issues with guys i think every girl in america has um I choke on my spit when I see a hot guy. I have a tendency to do absolutely bad. Like, it, it sounds kind of like Drake 4. <coughs> <coughs> Just like that. <coughs> which reminds me, which makes me always want to say, Agent Circle? Um, is here. That is not why we're doing this podcast. Okay, if he was here, I would not be on the phone right now. I'd be, like, in the other room on the bed. My mom's bed? Um, I, my best friend, besides her, um, is Mr. Chink. Oh. Which is gonna get me in trouble. He's so cute. He is. He's adorable. He's, like, my best. And he's really hot. He's my gay husband. Um, the reason I call him Mr. Chink, well, he knows it, and a lot of my friends know why I call him that. But for you people out there in the cyber world, you YouTubers who have no life, like, like us, us, um, he used to smoke something that would make him really hot, so his eyes go on chink, which is really, really racist, and I'm not racist by any mean. Of course you're not. Of course I'm not. Um, Why would you be? Exactly. I, I hate everybody equally. Um, hey, that's my line. I know. I stole it from you. But he is my best friend. Um her best friend, Agent Orange, is in Texas. Is that the biggest gay in America or something? That is. Um, who happens to be related to Old McDonald? They discovered Agent Sparkle, hottest guy on the planet. The Agent Orange. And Old McDonald. <laughs> and old, old McDonald. McDonald. Um, Agent Brightside. He's so funny. Agent Brightside <laughs> knows no, no boundaries, boundaries of personal bubble invasion. Personal bubble. He isn't he tall? He's actually really, really. He's kind of cute. A freaking teddy bear. He actually is kind of cute, really? in my opinion. Okay. He's pretty badass. Um, Agent Green. Christopher Agent Drew. Christopher Drew. Love because him. he's gorgeous. He smokes. He's yeah, he smokes the bad stuff, which I'm almost like bad. totally straight edge. Don't almost. drink. Don't do drugs. Don't do cocaine. Exactly. Um, Mr. Perfect. Jeremy, gorgeous little gay boy that I love so much. Yeah, he gives the best hugs, and he's so pretty. He is very pretty. He, he wears has, he wears better makeup than I do. I know he has the best eyeshadow. Um. Agent Love, Love Lemon, Lemon which brought us together. Our dead friend. Our dead, our dead oh friend. That's so sad to say. Um, but it's true. He's he was like a big brother to me. He's, he's actually awesome. coming. It's actually coming up to the one year since I met him. A year ago, I met him. It's almost a year since he died. Now. I know, which is really it's sad. Crazy. It seems like it was just yesterday. It it does still feel like yesterday to me. So it's a really touchy subject. Um, really focus on the positive. Let's focus him. on the positive. The little shit is probably laughing down at us right now, oh. being like, ha ha ha, ha. Uh, you guys are fine. Um, Agent to Babe. babe. Yeah. A weird kid, but pretty hot. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, the next one I have a nickname for, and she has a nickname for, mine is Mr. Krabs. <laughs> Mine is Agent Gluteus Orphus, because he doesn't know that it means asshole. And Mr. Krabs, because he probably has one. Oh, he um, does. He does, there's one. Shout out to my tattoo artist, Zach. Zach Man Pac-Man. Zach Man Pac-Man. Did both my lip rings and did my, my outline. He's going to finish it. Did three of my tattoos and touched up my wrist. Such a cool dude. Yeah, he's- He's, he's freaking awesome, and he's funny as hell. Um, Agent Pincock. <laughs> It's just fun. That's, that's actually his real that's name. That's his real last name is Pinkock. He will deny it till the end of the earth. Just saying that. Because it's really 
sad. Agent Bright Eyes. Jared Leto! Jared Leto! Um, Love of my life. Along with Christopher Drew and Chris Angel. Chris Angel. The Rev. The Rev. There's many of them. Rest in peace, The Rev. Right. Love you. Jimmy Sullivan. Peace and love. Um, Chomo. Chomo. We won't I even think get that into that. No, we won't even get into that. Chomo's just... <laughs> See, the issue with men, with me, is the friend zone. Like, mm. I'll have fun with them, and... They're do. usually my brothers, too. Yeah. Every guy I've ever <laughs> considered my brother. I didn't know about the first- Not blood brother, thank God. I didn't know about the first <laughs> two until after the second one. Yeah. But- Um, the third one was just happenstance. After I introduced you. Yeah, she did introduce us, and- I totally called it, too. I knew it was gonna happen. She did. She did call it, and- so did Mr. Krabs. Um. Well, Agent Gluteus Orcus can suck my left nut. Which he needs a set. Um. Yeah, he needs to grow a pair of balls and be a man. Take care of his three kids. <laughs> that he knows of. Um. M&M's are cool. I'm trying to open the bag. Not working in my favor right now. Um. What do you find attractive in a guy? People think I'm kidding when I talk about what I think I, I like in a guy. I like the really scrawny emo boys that wear eyeliner, love their mom, have, like, shitty cars that are falling apart. They have the, you know, hair. And, uh, let's see what else. They, um, they're like little wimps. Like, if somebody threatens to fight them, they're like, no, I those kind of boys and I'm not even lying I love them like especially the eyeliner part and if they play an instrument that's that's definitely a plus like they have an Australian accent and like a lot of mayonnaise on their sandwiches she <laughs> likes a lot of mayonnaise on her sandwiches and ranch and ranch but more mayonnaise than anything yeah. me um since I'm so short I am not a midget legally legal hey shut up I'm not a midget I'm actually, like, 5'2", five 5'3". Five I'm 5'7". So, anybody taller than me is a plus. I did that's, one. That's pretty wide. I did, <laughs> that's pretty, <laughs> a wide spectrum. But I did date someone shorter than me. Really? There's someone shorter than you? Yes. <laughs> and I dated a guy shorter than me. And <laughs> he was the sweetest boyfriend I ever had, dumb me after a month and a half. But he's still shorter than her. Um. He's actually my height. He's about as tall as me now. Which yeah. is sad. Um, I know, he was the sweetest boyfriend I've ever had, which is sad. I don't know, but for some reason I like long hair on guys. Oh my god. I always have. Um. And we're hairstylists. We're hairstylists, by the way. Or I am. She She's is a, a licensed future. hairstylist. She's a future professional. I'm in school. I'm a current professional. Me. It works. I know. Um. I got my eyebrows waxed for the first time ever. And the girl messed them up. How is it? How do they look? Better now. But worse than him. Um, just easygoing, laid back, video games. I know some girls are like, ew, video games. I'm like, dude, those are awesome. Um, I hate video games. I love video games. Agent Gluteus Orcus would not ever stop playing video games. Yeah. That's just something Same with Agent A. McDonald. <laughs> um, who got high off ibuprofen. <laughs> Seriously! <laughs> she was there! Um... Dude, dude, have you ever tried these? Yeah. Every time I get a boo-boo and I'm swollen. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, that's a completely different episode. But, um, yeah, just, I like books. I'm a nerd. <laughs> I like comic books. I'm a nerd. We're both nerds. That have no lives, apparently, since we're making this video. And we're talking about guys. Yes. That we can never touch. Like Adam Lambert. Well, she's touched a few of them on her list. I haven't. You make me blush, why don't you? You live to make <laughs> me blush. Don't even get me started, bitch. 